Hi guys, I was tagged by the beautiful Bonkers for Beauty and I think I've been tagged by somebody else to do this. Um, this is going to be the five products makeup. Um, the products that I'm going to be using are mostly Avon, funny enough. But I'm going to be using their Calming Effects powder and my shade for this is going to be Nude. Um, I'm also going to be using, I've not even tried using this yet, so you'll have to bear with me. Um, this is their Glimmer Sticks Brow Pencil. My shade was blonde. I'm going to be using this for my eyebrows, of course, and I'm going to try and use this as an eyeliner. See how I get on with that. And also on my eyes, I'm, well, my eyelashes, I'm going to be using my favourite mascara. This is the number 7's Intense Volume and on my cheeks and on my eyelid I'm going to be using the Avon um, Ideal Illuminous, not Illuminous, Ideal Luminous Peach and on my lips I'm going to be using an MUA Intense Kisses and this is in shade Quick Kiss, yeah Quick Kiss so I'm going, just going to get on with it. Um, I've already prepped my face and I'm going to put on the Avon Minerals. Um, the brush I'm going to be using, it won't be my retractable one. I can never get this open for some reason. That's it. Um, I've not got a big mirror so I'm going to have to use my viewfinder. I'm going to be using the Real Techniques Buffing brush, I should know what the brushes are by now. I, I like using this brush. I love all the Real Techniques brushes. And I'll normally start the centre. Sometimes just like to dab it on like that. And then buff it through and I've finished. When I've got it all on, I mean... If nobody's done this, I'd love to see you do it. I just can't remember who the other person was that tagged me. I don't get tagged very often either. So I was really chuffed when uh, Bonkers for Beauty tagged me. Depending on, on how much of this you put on, you can either have it light or medium coverage. I do wish I could find my favourite mirror. It would make it a lot easier. I like to put a little bit on my ear. Because I like to tuck my hair back. A minute with it being so warm. I did have my hair cut last week. I just had layers put through my hair and I still don't like it. My best friend likes it, but I think she's the only person that does actually. Oh, my parents, of course. They never mind how I have it. It's still me underneath. And my husband always says the same as well. Right. That's that. Um, next I'm going to be putting on my blusher. Where did I put that? That's ah, just there. I should put it on my cheeks first. It looks like this. It looks like it's gone all marbly, but it's one of my favourite um, blushes. I'm just going to put it on my cheeks first. I also like to use the um, Natural Collection Peach Blusher as well, but that seems a bit bit more matte, a bit more of a matte colour, should I say, not matte. I 
I can never get my blushes to look right, don't know why. As you can tell, I'm not a professional makeup artist. I'd just like to, I oh, will put a little bit up here just to, a bit under here. It's what I've been doing just lately, putting it under here and on the top there, just to give me a bit more colour all over the rest of my face. Right, I've just closed that and I'll need it again. I have got a little mirror in that, so I'm going to use that to just put it on my eyes. Um, I'm going to be using the Real Techniques. Deluxe crease brush, but I've been using this on my on the lid. Um, just take a little bit. Funny enough, when I was younger, I used to like putting my blusher on my eyes when I used to go out. I always found it was just a bit easier. I know why? Because I always had plenty of um, makeup even back then. And just a little bit up there. Do wish I didn't have hoodie dyes. Right, let's see. I'm going to get on with this. I'm not for eyeliner. I have actually taken it out just to have a look at it. And it's not very soft, so we'll see how I get on. It looks like that. Might not work, but we'll see. Let's just do my eyebrows first. I never, not very often I do my eyebrows. That's why I thought I'd treat myself to a nice... Well, it's lovely on the eyebrows. Definitely see a difference. There's been a few people that have asked me to do more of these sort of videos. But I just don't think I'm that good at putting makeup on. Well, that's what it looks like as a, as for my brows. It's quite nice. I quite like that. Now, let's see how we'll get on as an eyeliner. Let's just move that a bit. I don't normally put it full on, but I'm going to just... Can't really see it, but oh. still scared. I'm going to poke myself in the eye. I think that's enough for that. You can't really tell I've got that on. But at least I've had a go with it. I don't think I'll be using it for that anymore. And my favourite mascara. Love this. It's one of my faves. As you already know, I keep saying that. Not very often I curl my lashes, I ought to really, because they are quite straight. I 
this has been my favourite mascara for the last few years. No, I can't even tell I've got anything on my eyes now. And last but not least, my lip gloss. I love this. I think at most of these have I've actually been in a couple of my favourites videos. So, that's it. That's that finished. You can't really tell I've got anything on, especially on my eyes. Um, yeah, so like I've already just said, that's it for this video. And if you like it, please give it a thumbs up. And don't forget to subscribe if, you're, if you like my videos. And I shall see you all in my next video. Bye.